Hey everybody, Nick from Mary Madrao Detailing here, and on this week's 2 Minute Tuesday, I'm going to briefly talk about polishing aluminum. So you may have seen some pictures of some semis that I've pol polished before on my Facebook or Instagram, and you've seen probably before and after shots and thought to yourself, how did you turn that around from looking like a dull tank like this or a dull piece of aluminum into something that is extremely shiny? There are three main steps I'm going to break it into, which could easily be talked about for ages, but those are the, these are the three main steps that you need to take in to get a piece of aluminum looking from this to a mirror. So the first step is to inspect it. You want to visually inspect it and you want to physically inspect it. So visual inspection, what are you doing? You're going to look for any imperfections in the surface. So obviously this tank, first off, is dull, is gray, it's not very shiny. That's the first pointer. Next thing I'm going to look for is any gouges or any big rock chips. I've looked this tank over, there's nothing really to be of, like concerned about, so I'll move on to the next thing I have to look for. Are there any, is there any acid etching? Has this been washed with acid and stained? Nope, this tank looks all right. And we don't have anything that's to worry about with uh, fuel staining or anything like that on the tank itself here. I'm gonna physically inspect it. Okay, it's nice and rough, typical, I'm not surprised. So you wanna take some sandpaper, which is part of the second step here, and you wanna sand it which I'm going to show you on the other side here. Sanding is the key to getting it looking like a mirror. You'll want to sand out any imperfections. So this tank has been sanded with a few different steps. This is the final step of finished sanding already. You can already see kind of a reflection in it because this metal has now been transformed from a rough surface into an extremely flat and smooth surface. Like it's just pure smooth, like I can't feel anything on it. So once it's leveled like this through sanding, next step will be to actually polish it. And once you start polishing, I did a little test spot here, you'll end up with a mirror like this. So it's extremely reflective, super sharp, and that's because you properly sanded and got it ready to be cut. So once it's cut, you move on to the finishing steps, and those, once those are completed, you got a metal mirror. Those are the three main steps in polishing aluminum. I could talk about each one much more in depth, obviously, but I'm just gonna break, leave it like that. If you have a truck or anything needs to be polished, let me know, 306-621-0567, and I will help you out. Thanks again for watching, catch you next week.